Hey, I'm Alan Brito from Blender 3D Architect, and welcome to this tutorial about Blender 4.3 and the Measure It Arc add-on. Uh, in the past few tutorials that I posted here on the channel, I have been exploring the Measure It Arc add-on to add dimension lines, to create uh, 2D drawings, and export them as an SVG file uh, from uh, many different types of designs here in a Blender. It's an incredible add-on from uh, for anyone working with architecture, design, and engineering. And a concern that many people have about the Measure It Arc is that at some point in the future, it will stop working with uh, the latest version of Blender. And I have some great news. I have here Blender 4.3, the beta version, and it still works just fine with uh, this version of Blender. Uh, a great way to keep track of uh, Measure It Arc development is to visit the GitHub page of the add-on. I will leave links for uh, Measure It Arc and the beta version of Blender here in the description of the video in case you wanted to download them. Uh, and you can see here that many of the files that makes uh, this uh, add-on they have been updated uh, pretty recently. This one here was updated last week. Uh, we have another one here with an update uh, in the previous week. This means uh, the main dev uh, or someone is updating uh, the Python files, the, the core files of uh, the add-on. If you want to try and install this add-on, it's not part of the Blender official extension repository. You have to come here uh, in this address and download it as a zip. And once you download it as a zip, you will be able to install the Measure It Arc by going here in a Blender, in Edit, Preferences, and under Add-ons, you will choose this option here, Install from Disk, and it will appear here on this list, Add-ons. If I enable it here, you will see a new tab on your sidebar, the Measure It Arc. Let me just add some quick dimensions here so you can see it working. Let me set it to show. Let's go in edit mode and I will add a new dimension. And as you can see, it still works. Uh, how to get the beta version of Blender? Let me show you. If you open at the Blender Foundation website, you will see here an option to download Blender. If I open this here, you will see that they just added this option, Blender 4.3 beta. You can uh, click on this link or you can scroll down and go to download Blender Experimental and you will open the daily builds section. And there you will find the Blender uh, 4.3 beta and you can even get uh, Blender 4.4, the alpha version, which I, I do not recommend uh, to uh, download right now, unless of course you know what you are doing, you wanna test, you wanna uh, explore uh, possible new features. So go ahead and download it, but uh, be aware that alpha software is uh, usually really unstable. So this is uh, just some quick update about the Measure It Arc because it's an incredible and useful add-on for anyone working with architecture, engineering, and design. And in case you want to explore Blender even more, I just have uh, released uh, in, the in the previous weeks a new workshop, Blender 4.2, uh, Precise Modeling for Architecture, uh, Engineering, and 3D Printing. I will leave links in the description. Everything in the workshop works just fine with Blender 4.3 as well. See you next time. Bye.